In this video, we will cover white color alignment. This video was created using Windows 7. You'll need to perform the white color alignment with the printer during the setup process or when replacing a printhead. You'll need a dark colored t-shirt that has been pre-treated to perform this adjustment. To begin the process, ensure the printer is first connected to a PC via a LAN or USB connection. First, go to the Windows Start button, then go to All Programs. From there, go to the folder named Brother GTX4 Tools and open it. Next, click on GTX4 Maintenance. This will launch the Maintenance Tool program. From here, first ensure your printer is connected and you have it selected at the top drop down, specifically in the case if you have multiple printers. Next, ensure the radio button for white color alignment is checked then click Next. It is important that you already have performed both the V-rating, firing, and platen feeding adjustments before proceeding with the white color alignment. If you have not done so, go back to the main menu and perform those steps. You will be asked to have the dark pre-treated garment prepared for this adjustment. You will also be asked to check the platen height is set to level A. Once you click on Next, the file will be sent over to the printer. The new file will be received and show on the panel. Please ensure that the align check is displayed on the panel. The file will print in the center of the platen. It may be hard to see on screen as the file is small black boxes. We can now proceed to dress the dark pretreated t-shirt onto the platen. It is important to ensure that it is completely flat without wrinkles and tucked onto the tray. Ensure the garment is secured onto the platen as flatly as possible before proceeding. We can now press the green print button to start the print. Note for this demonstration, we will not show the actual file printing, only the platen going in and out as the files are printed. Once the shirt is ejected from the printer, you may leave it there. However, you will either need a photo of the alignment check or you'll need to note the settings and enter them into the tool. Back at the PC, we can now click Next. On the screen, we will need to enter the values for the box on the grid pattern which has the best alignment or the least white peeking out around the edges in any given direction. These are called the X and Y coordinates. Let's look at the photo we took of our printed pattern. Here you can see that the X plus 2 and Y plus 4 are the values that have the least white peeking out around the black box at that coordinate. We will input those values into the drop down boxes that correspond with X and Y in the tool. When finished, we will click on Next. The printer will pong letting us know the updated check pattern information has been sent to the printer. The file on the display, however, will not change. We can now move the garment up further on the platen to make room for the second print. Please note if you have trouble doing this, you can always use another pre-treated dark garment. Here again, we need to get the garment as smooth as possible on the platen and tuck very well to avoid the garment shifting during this print. These prints occur with two passes, so shifting can affect the results of the print. Once we have the garment ready, we can proceed by pressing the green print button. After the garment has finished printing, we either need to take a photo of the adjusted print or take note of the coordinates for the black box that show the least white as any given edge. Back at the PC, we can click Next. On the screen, we'll be asked if there is no white line showing at coordinates 0, 0. Let's evaluate our print. In our printout, the coordinates that have the least to no white lines peeking out around the edges of the black box are X0 and Y0. So back in the tool, we can answer yes to the question. In the event you answer no, because the best coordinates were not X0 or Y0, you'll need to enter the coordinates that are and click next to create yet one more printout. This means you'll need another pre-treated black shirt as well. If after the printout you are unable to achieve the 00 coordinates needed, then you will need to start this process over from the very beginning. Never exit the tool, however, once you have started the process as it can cause misalignment. The process must be completed all the way even if you need to start over. Once it is completed with good results, you can click Next. This will take you back to the main menu. This concludes all adjustments if you are setting up the printer or replacing a printhead. Unless you're setting up a LAN connection, you can close the tool and begin printing. If you need additional support, please fill out our web form at brotherdtg.com forward slash help.
for further assistance.